so what's up my beautiful people welcome back to my youtube channel this is Samuel travel in history and if this is your very first time please consider to subscribe to my youtube channel because today i want to take you to the old town of Mombasa at night and show you how it is or how it looks like at night so please if this is your very first time just do me the honors of subscribing and let's enjoy the vibe of old town of Mombasa at night so stay tuned keep calm and let's enjoy the video up to the last decimal point please share like subscribe man So what's up guys man i'm going to be taking you on a tour of old town of mombasa at night i hope you can see how beautiful it is with all these lightings and everything like that please guys i want to show you how the old town of mombasa looks like at night man look with all these lightings and everything guys so guys, I just wanna you want you to bear with me because like I had not planned about this trip or this video. It was just random. I just came off from work and I decided let me just show you how it looks like. So guys, as you can tell, man, it looks wonderful at night. It's just chill, quiet. Man, it's beautiful how it is, man. Look at the vibrance of old town of Mombasa at night, man. I was like, mm, let me just go home or let me just go out and try to see what I can see at night, man. But to my surprise, damn this is beautiful man this is gorgeous and i have to be careful over here because of uh, the narrow streets and the cars are passing by and uh wow look how amazing it is at night man i didn't know this is how beautiful it is at night look at these lightings man wow and this is the first african hotel in Kenya man 1901 you can see there so oh, sorry for that so guys look at these lightings over here man oh damn so guys I'm trying to be careful here because of the tuk-tuks that are passing by you know the small narrow streets man look this is amazing man wow So guys, I didn't expect something like this to be happening in old town of Mombasa. You know, the thing is, like, the cultural influence that is here in Mombasa, it plays a huge role in the beautification that happens in Mombasa at night, man. Look, I, I, I don't even have words to explain on how this beauty it is, man. It's amazing. It's beautiful. Wow. Look at this. Wow. This magical man. Look at this man. Wow. So let me just turn around and show you how this how this street looks like, man. Look at that. Oh, that guy is trying to warn me to be careful because of the cars that are passing by. But 
I'm so excited. I'm so amazed by these lightings that have been put over here. This is wonderful. This is crazy, man. So, this is how old town of Mombasa looks like at night. Uh, for those who don't know, this was the first Portuguese church that was here. But right now, it has been turned into a medical center. Yes, you can see from here. That is the medical center. The first Portuguese church it was turned to me at the medical center. And, uh, yeah. This is the first mosque in Kenya around 300 years ago. That's when it was constructed. That's the first mosque, and that is the name Hundre Mosque. So, so guys, this is just but a casual tour in the old town of Mombasa at night, you know. And uh, you can see how buildings looks like here, house to let or house to for sale. Because of how old it is. Oh, I can see people who have Liverpool fans here. Look at this. Liverpool. Yeah, you have fans here in Kenya. So, some streets are dark like that one. Look at these balconies over here. So, for those who don't know, Mombasa has the influence of uh, British influence. Arab influence, Indian influence, that you can, you can see the different types of balconies over here because of that influence, you know. This is for Rodani, the best hotel you can find for seafood here in Mombasa. So this is how it looks like, man. This is so wonderful, man. I didn't know this is how Mombasa looks like at night. So this is for Lodani. What's an Aki, thank you. Let me just walk and see how it looks like because I just want to see the view from the ocean, you know. You only a lot of customers will even get nice view and then I decide, oh, let me just have something. You see, that's how you attract customers. You know, you don't just tell them, oh, don't go because we allow, allow customers only. <laughs> Thank you. So, guys, I was trying to have a conversation with that guy so that he can allow me to come in and let me show you how this place looks like. So you can see the view, you know. Wow. So this is the view from up here, man. This is the Forodani Hotel, man. I just want to show you. This is Forodani, the best hotel here in Mombasa with, for seafood, man. So let me just show you how it looks like. Just to, to give, give you a glimpse on how the ocean looks like at night. Look at this man. So from that is the old port of Mombasa. That's where the Persians, the Indians, the British and the slave shipments were docked during the... What do I say? When the, there was the coronation or the scramble for control of East African Harbor. So guys, that side, that is the English Point Marina. That's amazing. And this is the Fall of Dani. Wow. Look at this, man. This is why you just come have the best seafood in Mombasa. Wow. Look how it looks like. So... I'm just giving you a small glimpse so that you can see how Mombasa looks like at night, the life, the vibrance, and everything like that. So, I hope you love this video, man. So, that's how it looks like. This is followed then. Hi, Asante.
guys for those who didn't know more about the old town of Mombasa it dates back to 900 AD men that's when it all started because of the trade that was happening between India and Kenya and uh, the Persians the Indians and the Portuguese were trying to have a take on the East African coast and control it because of the trade that was happening so that's how it ended up growing all it ended up being established this town has more it has building that are more than 400 years 500 years 300 years dating back into those days so i hope you're enjoying this video because it has a lot to be told and this is just a casual walk in the old town of mombasa so just hit that like button and subscribe to experience this more often let's, let's continue exploring this street man i hope i don't get robbed but i'm not hoping to go to the interior because i have heard that it's not that safe to be around here at night you know so guys we are still exploring the street of mombasa or the old town of mombasa and the amazing thing that i have found is that look at these all lightings that have been put over here on the street of mombasa these streets are very narrow so i have to be very careful as i walk or try to navigate through them but look at this man look at that look at that you know there is there is a difference between a traveler and there is a difference between a traveler who really likes to experience the joy of a certain city or try to know what is the that city made of so this is the vibrance this is the experience man i'm getting over here man look it's amazing so let's continue enjoying this city vibe man this streets vibe you know So guys, light where I'm standing, these are stairs leading to a well-maintained uh, position or an elevated position whereby you can see it. I know you cannot see it right now very clearly because it's at night time and I wanted to give you this uh, night time vibrance or experience on how Old Town looks like. But you can see here if, let me try to put on, you can see here. This is just an elevated position where you can just sit or relax as you watch the ocean, man. Look, these are kind of benches whereby you sit as you watch the ocean or maybe experience the experience that you want to feel, you know. So, you can hear how calm or how the ocean or the breeze hits you, man, when you are relaxing over here, you know. I know you cannot see it right now, but you can hear the thrashing of water, man. On the other side, from that side, that is English Point Marina. And uh, it, uh, one of the best hotels here in Mombasa, whereby exclusive all, do I say those people who, maybe celebrities, governors, people of certain stat, uh, stat, uh, status, have their fun, man. You can see, look at that outline of the light and everything like that, you know. So basically, this is the vibe that I'm getting over here. I think maybe you can hear the how the wind is blowing. This is the breeze, man. This is another elevated point whereby you can watch the ocean man flow. Look and palm trees like a small beach over there where you can swim you know you cannot see this at night man so this is the vibe that i wanted to give you guys the vibe of the night man that is fort jesus over there over there man you know so i hope you have watched my previous video about the old town of mombasa it has so much details on uh, what 
old town entails but i just wanted to give you all to show you the glimpse on how old town of mombasa looks like at night